Hello, my name is Matt Metcalf. As I sit here in this poorly lit room, I am here to give everyone some words of encouragement that uh, our lives have changed a tad and I would like to offer some words of encouragement along with some instruction on some really basic DBT skills, uh, which are to come, obviously. Um, so the most important thing if you have teenagers is to create a schedule. Um, schedules are extremely hard to complete when kiddos have various places that they go, like school or somewhere else or another place and then another place, yada, yada, yada. Since now we live in an era where people are all at home, um, the idea of being able to monitor and keep a closer eye on schedule is easier uh, on paper. And then obviously it can be much more difficult just because of how tiring it can be to have to be around your kid that much. However, uh, the first thing that I would say that needs to be established beyond just basic safety uh, would be a schedule for your teenager. So that is the first thing that we would do. Um, I recommend making it very simple and just having about five steps in it and not overdoing it. Um, so it can look something like this. My camera fell. Back. Okay. Uh, nope, I don't like it. Oh, let's say... Uh, I would just use five things. I would focus on a wake up time. I would focus on a morning activity that's typically centered around academics. Um, the third thing, I would focus on some kind of labor type thing. Uh, not so much manual labor, but like chores, uh, some form of cleaning. I would definitely not focus on the tasks. I would focus on the duration of time uh, and then I would focus on some form of outing, which could be walks around the block, uh, any kind of fresh air related thing. Uh, it could even be time in the backyard, whatever. And then of course, last but not least, I would recommend some form of recreational or free time. Uh, obviously all necessary appointments apply. The sooner you get in the swing of things in terms of schedule, um, the easier each day is going to get in terms of waking up and going to bed. And when schedule has been established, then you're good to go. Uh, if you have any questions, uh, feel free to reach out. I would love to hear from you and we will continue with this. Thank you.